All right, let's take a look at this in regular speed. One, two. All right, I would call that swinging on three. So to hit the ball by three, you're gonna need to pick up your foot, or at least be thinking about picking up your foot on two, and get it down by two and a half to be able to hit the ball by three. So let's count that again. One, two. One, two, three. So the three actually comes before it hits the catcher's mitt. So you're trying to hit that ball out in front, and we want to hit it like right there. Okay, now let's watch again. That's where you want to hit it. Hands are still back. That's where the ball got. Let's turn this to red. Ball got right there. All right, your hands are still back. Zoom in. And that is right where your bat actually tried to hit the ball. So I think you're doing a good job of understanding where you want to hit it. It's just that your timing is too late to do so. So let's clear this and look at this in slow motion and see at what point in time you get your front foot down. On one, which is right here as the, as the hand crosses the hip, that's one. All right, now her stride forward to right here is two, right there, that release, two. So right now your front foot needs to be picked up, like you need to be getting this up now. So let's see at what point you do pick it up. How far does the ball travel before you pick your foot up? Okay, foot is off the ground and the ball is here. Let's go a little further. Foot hits the ground. I'd say halfway is right there. All right, so let's mark that with a line. This is the halfway mark. All right, here we go. Your front foot is actually making contact with the ground now, but now your, your leg is actually like getting into the dirt, like you're, you're digging in here, you're getting connected with the ground. So legs look good, but the front foot connects finally here. And I'm gonna put a yellow because I know it's already late. Well, because we already know that the green line is halfway and that's where we wanted to get our foot down. Let's keep going. Um, we've got our desired contact point somewhere right there. It's going to be, it, you could have hit that right there, but just a little bit deeper. I would say green zone would have been about there. Yellow zone would be about here. Red is by your feet, or in between your feet. So what we're looking at is where does the barrel actually try to hit the ball? You were trying to hit it there. That's where you threw the weight. That was great. So when was the ball there? At this time. Okay, so you're about two clicks too late, right there. You need to be getting your barrel there, or actually you need to get your elbows more like, like this when the ball is here, okay? Because the very next step is you actually throwing your weight to the ball. So at this point, the ball's almost in the catcher's mitt, right when you're finally snapping to the green zone. Like, you gotta get that going earlier. So because your foot didn't get down until there, okay, you were just a little bit too late. Like it makes a huge difference at the plate when that ball finally gets to you, okay? So think about picking up your foot. I'm going to zoom out just a tad. That pitcher has is, is got her foot down. You should be picking your foot up right now. Okay, pick it up, set it down, go attack. Push forward more, go get it, go get it, go get it. Don't just stay there and wait for it to come to you. See how that body's just staying there? It's because you are late. There is no reason to go forward because you can't. There's only, there's only one way to move to hit this right now, and that's backwards, okay, which is why you missed it. So there's no reason to move backwards unless you're late and you were late. You didn't move backwards. That's okay. You just need to start earlier, all right? So let's look at the picture again and figure out what to do whenever she's doing her stuff. We've got, start it over. The backswing does not count. We count here, one, two, and it'll be at the green zone stick by three. 
Let's count it out loud together. One, two, three. One, two, three. So we got to get the barrel way further on the front. Anyways, you got this. Good luck. Go get him, kid.